Hey everyone, hope you're all doing well. Thank you for stopping by my channel. I made this video to show some progress of how the corals are doing. Everything looks good. I did take out all the A-cans and put them in the Nuvo 30 as that will be more of an LPS tank that I can run a little more dirty. They're now fluffier than ever. The next video will be of the Nuvo 30. I'm not sure if I mentioned in my previous videos, I did find some acro eating flatworms in the tank. I had a PC rainbow that you could see the tiny bites all over it and was losing color. Also my acid trip millipora and Jason Fox solar flare millipora had lost all color and had no polyp extension. I was close to losing them. I immediately bought a six line rasp and a millinaris rasp to help with the pest. The first thing I did was to dip the corals. I also purchased a flow pump that I attached a small hose to it and every day began flushing the corals with tons of water flow. I can see small flatworms flying off the corals and the wrasses would just eat them up right away and have gotten a nice taste for them. Finally the last thing I did was to treat the tank daily with flatworm stop which helps the corals build up their slime coat and starve out the acro eating flatworms. I can say today that the corals are looking better than ever. I haven't seen a flatworm in a long time. I believe the key to my success was acting early and knowing what to do. If you wait till your tank is overran, the battle will be much harder. As far as lighting goes, I did get a lot of comments previously on how low I run the whites over my tank. So I bumped them up from 5 to 15% for a few hours during peak time. I see some of the corals have gotten some new small growth spurts on their tips. But remember, never do anything quickly or too drastic when it has to do with your reef tank. Well that's it for now everyone. Please leave your comments or questions below and I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Y'all take care.